Kayan are an ethnic minority of Myanmar, and Pada Ung are the group in which the women wear the brass neck coils. In the late 1980s and early 1990s, due to conflict with the military regime in Myanmar, many Kayan tribes fled to the Thai border area. Among the refugee camps set up, there was a long neck section, which became a self sufficient tourist site generating enough revenue to support themselves and therefore did not need financial assistance. Girls first start to wear rings when they are around five years old. Over the years the coil is replaced by a longer one and more turns are added. The weight of the brass pushes the collarbone down and compresses the rib cage. The neck itself is not lengthened. The appearance of a stretched neck is created by the deformation of the clavicle. Many ideas regarding why the coils are worn have been suggested. These ideas are often formed by visiting anthropologists who have hypothesized that the rings protected women from being slaves by making them less attractive to other tribes. It has also been theorized that the coils originate from the desire to look more attractive by exaggerating sexual dimorphism as women have more slender necks than men. It has also been suggested that the coils give the woman resemblance to a dragon, that being an important figure in Kayan folklore. Also, the coils might be meant to protect them from tiger bites, perhaps literally, but probably symbolically. Kayan women, when asked, acknowledge these ideas and often say that their purpose for wearing the rings is cultural identity, an identity associated with beauty. The coil is seldom removed. As the coiling and uncoiling is a lengthy procedure, it is usually only removed to be replaced by a new or longer coil. The muscles covered by the coil become weakened. Many women have removed the rings for medical examinations. Most women prefer to wear the rings once their clavicle has been lowered, as the area of the neck and the collarbone often become bruised and discoloured. Additionally, the collar feels like an internal part of the body after 10 or more years of continuous wear. In 2006, some of the younger women in the Mei Hong Song started to remove their rings, either to give them the opportunity to continue their education or in protest against the exploitation of their culture and the restrictions that came with it. In late, 2008, most of the young women who entered the refugee camp removed their rings. One woman who had worn the ring for over 40 years removed them and reported the discomfort that followed faded after about three days, but the discoloration of the flesh was more persistent. Okay, I have the model for you. Long way, huh? You can touch. Yes. 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 Okay, now uh -huh. this one uh -huh, we call Karen Long Neck, and this group long time ago they moved from Myanmar, uh -huh, maybe about more than 200 years ago. After Second War in Myanmar, they moved to Thailand, to around the border in Thailand. Uh -huh. The first area they moved to Mae Hong Son province and then Chiang Mai and Chiang Rai separate area because it's a three province around the northern zone. It's a, like a Myanmar border. Uh -huh. 
they why they don't, uh, why they live from Myanmar นะคะ because long time ago Myanmar communist country mm. uh, and the uh, control by the shoulder mm. everything then to run for the new tribe people mm. uh -huh, everything uh -huh. and then after second war they moved to Thailand around the border in Thailand uh -huh. they moved live in the mountain and then they control by the Thai shoulder everything support from the Thai shoulder in the past uh -huh. lady she start put the ring this one uh -huh. one or two ring start about five years old Five years old, uh -huh. and then one year or two year up model ring until 27 to 30 ring finish no more. Same her, wow. uh -huh. maybe about five kilogram. Wow. Uh -huh. Normally, only lady oh, was born Wednesday on the night time must put the ring. Oh. Uh, because it's uh, when lady was born on night time Wednesday, bad luck. Oh. So only the lady that are born on Yeah, and on after Wednesday, that... At night they mm. were the ring. Yes, and after that, the photo. Uh -huh. Every lady in this group must wear the ring. Why? Like a culture. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, culture. Like a culture. And then, protection animal. Because oh. they uh, live in the jungle. A lot of animal. As a big animal, uh -huh, like a tiger. Ah, uh, they protection the tiger, and below the knee, ah, uh, they put the ring also. There is uh, because some lady she would like to have small leg, ah, uh, because she think if lady small leg, small hand, so beautiful, uh, so beautiful. Uh. Bye bye. Oh, your cap.